Hi, my name is Jason and we're excited about this week's Technique of the Week. This is a really cool, cool trick that we're going to be showing you. Um, when we're doing something like this with uh, colored integral concrete, a lot of times, you know, when you strip the forms, whether it's a step or one of these uh, Stegmeier forms we're using, uh, these styrofoam forms or, or whatever you're doing, um, with integral color it's really tough if you have some bug holes and some different stuff or a piece chips off to be able to get that color to match perfectly. So what we're going to be showing you today is a couple techniques on how to, on how to um, be able to match color and fix those holes if you can't rub enough out. So for this week's technique, we're going to be uh, drilling holes in a bucket. We're going to drill um, you know, 50 to 60 quarter inch holes in this bucket about, oh, about a quarter of the way up. And then what we're going to be doing with that is putting some of the leftover concrete uh, I know you guys aren't that good where you're going to have just the right amount of concrete at the end of a job. So, um, you know, with the leftover concrete that, that we were going to put it in the, a little bit of it in the bucket, we're going to vibrate it. And then um, that's going to separate all the fine stuff. It's only those quarter inch holes, you know, are only going to let out uh, the good stuff that we want to be able to slurry. It takes all the big rocks out of it. So we're going to put them on the, in the sides of the bucket and we're also going to put them on the bottom of the bucket. There we go. That's all we need to do. Now we'll wait until uh, they're done pouring the concrete here and you know, then we'll be able to put a little bit in here. We've got all done pouring all the concretes down. Um, and what we've done is just have a, you know, a half a wheelbarrow left of, of the leftover concrete. And all I'm gonna do is take a couple shovels full here. You only wanna fill this bucket up to basically the, to where your top of your hole, you get too much concrete in there, it doesn't really work. So it's best just to, um, you know, recycle it, uh, dump, dump the, what you've already, once you've got enough of it out of there, um, dump it out and then do it again. This technique, this only works with DecoCrete buckets. You cannot use any other buckets with this. Um, it's, uh, it only works to drill holes with DecoCrete buckets. Sorry, that's just uh, how it works. So when you do this, uh, you have a piece of plastic, you know, all your uh, drippings that went on there. Um, we want to try to keep that as fresh as possible because um, you know, in the, in the heat of the day, we don't want to leave it lay out here in the sun, obviously. So what we're going to do is fold this plastic up, um, just kind of drape it over top of itself like this. Kind of just fold that, fold that up like that. And what that's going to do is seal all the moisture in there so it can't get out. It'll, it'll last a lot longer. Um, and then, you know, a lot of times what I've done with this is uh, if it's really hot, is put it like in an igloo cooler or something like that. Or you can also, I put it in people's refrigerators, you know, just to keep it kind of kind of cool. But at the very least, uh, put it somewhere in the shade. The concrete's starting to get to the point where we're ready to start finishing the edge of this. So I'm going to get out my, my plastic here. I'm going to open this back up. As you can see, it's still pretty, pretty good. Um, I haven't added any water to it or anything. Um, we put it in the shade, it's still pretty, you can see it's pretty pliable. So I'm gonna do, I'm not gonna put, put all this down in there, I don't need all of it right this second, so I'm just gonna put some in this uh, coffee cup, or a coffee container. I'm just gonna take a regular margin trowel, put a little bit on there. Now obviously this, you know, some of these, I'm gonna fix the worst of the, of the holes. You know, we can use this to kinda put a little bit of this on there. Where this really helps is if it's starting to maybe get away, a little bit away from you and it's hard to uh, work up some cream. Um, but this will work, work real good to just do this. Now, obviously I'm not gonna rub this whole thing with a margin trowel, this whole way around this whole pool deck. Pool deck. So um, in a couple weeks, we're gonna be showing you um, how, how to make a tool to be able to do this stuff. But you're, you're gonna have to wait for that one till, till next, uh, to when we decide to release that one. But that's all for this week on Technique of the Week. Um, again, real easy to do. Make a, drill some holes in a bucket and use it to, to fill your holes. So hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, we'll see you next time. Technique of the Week, thanks.